My name is Ryan S. Blair, and I am an adventure racer. And I come from the west coast of the United States, but I've been in Asia for over 20 years, um, much of that based in Hong Kong. Um, I'm a director of a group of outdoor companies, and uh, one of many things that we're involved with is managing uh, Asia's, uh, one of if not Asia's top adventure sport athlete team um, over the last decade. Yeah, our team is the North Face Adventure Team. I'm, I'm the director of the team, um, but I'm also an athlete. And basically there's around nine or ten of us in any given year um, that compete. All of us are either local, um, locally from Asia or based in Asia. And we compete primarily in adventure racing, trail running, mountain biking, Yeah, so we started the team 10 years ago. Key reason for the establishing the team was is, is to really, you know, it's hard to get sponsorship in these kind of sports for athletes. I really wanted to give um, local Asians the opportunity to, you know, those that have potential to really reach their full potential. So it, it's not, and it's not just about race opportunity, it's also it's life opportunity. Um, but adventure racing usually is a team, um, uh, you know, it's, it's a team of two, three, or four. So the whole team dynamic um, is something, you know, a lot of endurance and adventure sports are solo sports. You know, trail running tends to be mountain bike. You know, one plus one does not equal two. You can achieve so much more actually with a team than by yourself. And that's something that you find very often the case in adventure racing. We do a lot of multi-day racing, and so the benefits of trying to improve your recovery time or de decrease your recovery time, um, enhance circulation, all, all this uh, is assen you know, essential. I've tried many different shorts over the years in terms of tight shorts, and I find that it's, that, that, it's unparalleled. 